The Art of Face Reading in Chinese Medicine Unlocking the Secrets of Health and Well-Being Traditional Chinese Medicine, TCM, has offered a holistic approach to health. Focusing on the balance of energies within the body for centuries. One fascinating aspect of TCM is the ancient art of face reading and physiognomy. This practice involves observing and analyzing facial features to gain insight into a person's health, personality traits, and life potential. Rooted in the belief that the face reflects one's internal state. Face reading has been utilized as a diagnostic tool to understand an individual's physical, emotional, and spiritual well-being. Historical Significance Face reading has been integral to Chinese culture for over 3,000 years. It is mentioned in ancient Chinese texts, such as the Wangdi Neijing, Yellow Emperor's Inner Canon. One of the foundational texts of TCM. Face reading techniques have been passed down through generations of practitioners and are still widely used today. Critical Principles of Face Reading According to TCM principles, the face is a microcosm of the body. And each feature corresponds to specific organs, meridians, and energetic systems. Here are some fundamental principles of face reading. Number 1. The Five Elements TCM is based on the concept of five elements. Wood, fire, earth, metal, and water. That represent different energies in nature and the human body. Each element is associated with specific facial features, such as the forehead, eyes, nose, cheeks, and chin. Which can reveal information about a person's constitution and potential imbalances. Here are some common associations between facial features and the five elements in TCM. Eye wood element. Forehead. The width and prominence of the forehead are associated with the wood element. A broad forehead is a characteristic of individuals with a vital wood element. Representing qualities such as creativity, determination, and assertiveness. 2. Fire element. Eyes. The eyes are associated with the fire element in TCM. Sparkling, bright, and lively eyes are considered signs of a vital fire element. They are associated with qualities like passion, joy, and emotional expression. 3. Earth Element. Cheeks. The cheeks are associated with the earth element. Well-rounded and rosy cheeks indicate a harmonious earth element, representing nurturing, stability, and groundedness traits. IV. Metal Element. Nose. The nose is associated with the metal element. In TCM, a straight and well-defined nose is considered a sign of a vital metal element. Symbolizing precision, organization, and discipline. Versus water element. Chin and ears. The chin and ears are associated with the water element. A well-defined chin and prominent ears indicate a vital water element, representing wisdom, adaptability, and a deep sense of introspection. Number 2. Color and Complexion. The color and complexion of the face provide valuable clues about one's overall health. A pale or dull complexion may indicate blood deficiency. In contrast, a ruddy complexion might suggest excessive heat or inflammation in the body. Number 3. Lines and Wrinkles. The lines and wrinkles on the face can indicate the state of an individual's health and emotional well-being. For example, deep furrows between the eyebrows may suggest excessive worry or stress. At the same time, fine lines around the mouth might indicate digestive issues. Number 4. Facial Shapes and Structures. Different facial shapes and structures are associated with distinct personality traits and health tendencies. For instance, a round face is believed to signify a warm and nurturing personality. In contrast, a square look might indicate strength and determination. If you found value so far in this video please give it a thumbs up, like and subscribe to support this channel, it will be appreciated. Applications of Face Reading In TCM, face reading serves multiple purposes. Diagnostic Tool TCM practitioners use face reading as a diagnostic tool to assess a person's internal imbalances and health conditions. By carefully examining facial features, they can identify potential weaknesses or imbalances in specific organs or energetic systems. For instance, a person with deep furrows between the eyebrows may indicate excessive worry or stress, which could indicate potential digestive system imbalances. 
Fine lines around the mouth suggest digestive issues or imbalances in the stomach or spleen meridians. A pale or dull complexion may indicate blood deficiency or poor circulation. Personalized treatment. Based on the findings from the face reading, TCM practitioners can tailor treatments to address specific health concerns, including herbal remedies, acupuncture, dietary adjustments, and lifestyle recommendations. For example, suppose a face reading reveals signs of excessive heat, such as a ruddy complexion or redness in the cheeks. In that case, a practitioner might prescribe cooling herbs or recommend dietary modifications to reduce inflammation. If face reading indicates imbalances in specific organs, acupuncture points, or meridians related to those organs can be targeted during treatments. Self-reflection and awareness. Face reading can also be a tool for self-reflection and personal growth. By becoming aware of the messages conveyed by their facial features, individuals can gain insight into their strengths, weaknesses, and emotional patterns. This self-awareness can support personal development and cultivate a balanced and harmonious life. Limitations and Risks While face reading can provide valuable insights, it is essential to recognize its limitations and potential risks. Face reading should not be used as a sole diagnostic tool, and its findings should be considered within the broader context of a comprehensive TCM assessment. Misinterpretation or misdiagnosis is possible, as facial features can vary among individuals. And other factors may influence their appearance. It is advisable to consult a qualified TCM practitioner for a complete evaluation. Scientific research and evidence. It is essential to acknowledge that scientific research on face reading in TCM is limited. And more studies are needed to validate its efficacy. While anecdotal evidence and historical documentation support its use, the subjective nature of face reading makes it challenging to apply the principles in a controlled scientific setting. However, face reading is often integrative, combining traditional practices with modern medical diagnostics and treatments. Face reading is a unique and fascinating aspect of traditional Chinese medicine that offers valuable insights into an individual's health and well-being. By carefully analyzing the face, TCM practitioners can unlock clues about one's physical, emotional, and spiritual state. As a holistic practice, face reading is a diagnostic tool for personal growth and self-reflection. By embracing this ancient art, we can deepen our understanding of ourselves and work towards achieving a harmonious and balanced life. If you enjoy this video please give it a thumbs up, like and subscribe to our channel for more self-improvement videos. Please share your thoughts in the comment section below. Don't forget to share and click the notification bell to get notified anytime we post a new video. Thanks for watching, see you in the next video.